Hey, what's up, guys? Saturday. This is April, April 10th. 9.18 a.m. After my coffee, I'll probably go to the post office to see if my uh, black Latigo strap came in. I did get my other two yesterday. <coughs> there was uh, floating around in Rochester for like fucking nine days. Got that out of the way. Uh... Cloudy. A little, little chilly. It's supposed to warm up. Today's coffee Maxwell House Medium Roast. The legend has retired. Maybe later I'll go uh, pick up some Chinese for uh, supper. Post office opens uh, 8 o'clock, but I'm, I'm giving it some time because the fucking girl is so slow, you know? How many times I go there in the morning, I got nothing, I leave... Then she puts the fucking mail in my box. <coughs> mail, packages, cigars. You know, when I go home a little later, I, I check on the my emails and stuff. Oh, I got a fucking package. Yeah. All right. Get back in the Jeep and go back to the fucking post office. I'm waiting for the, uh, usually get bank statements, you know. Let's see if my uh, if I got the stimulus check. <coughs> it's in the bank. I'll fucking take it out. Put some to my savings. I call it pension. And uh, pick up some more cigars. Yesterday, I I, uh, I had some uh, barbecued some uh, hot dogs. They were uh, Hebrew National hot dogs. They're really good, you know. I don't recall ever having them. <coughs> I think they were beef. Usually, I get like pork, uh, pork and chicken pot, hot dogs. Those are gonna fucking cheap, you know. That, that double double S bar, double R bar, whatever the hell. That cheap shit. I don't care, you know. I'm just fucking cheap. Grass is uh, the grass is green. I don't say getting green. It is green now. I think you know the season is here. You know, warm side for. I got some time to pick up another bag of uh, mothballs because where I sit out here, I noticed last year we have snakes. See, upstate, they call them garden snakes. Well, these fucking things are brown. They're, to me, they ain't garden snakes because where I come from, Long Island, garden snakes are those green little ones that you can pick them up and play with them. Ah. Up here, no, they fucking brown. They got all kinds of dots on them. And <clears throat> anyway, I noticed that uh, when I uh, had the mothballs out last year, they stopped coming around. Good. 
fuck. What else am I going to do today? Uh, Monday I got to go to the doctor. My, you know, every three month checkup for my heart. <coughs> Give me the same fucking shit, you know. Oh, your blood pressure's a little high. Yeah. Maybe because I'm here and I'm fucking aggravated. I don't know what you're going to do, what you're going to ask me. I'm aggravated because you keep coming here and you're not fucking helping me. Yeah, keep taking the cholesterol pills. You're yeah, fine, whatever. Pay my five dollars and get the hell out of there. That's something to do, you know. Take a nice drive. Fucking shoot me. See you in three fucking months. Every six months I go to the vascular doctor for fucking tests. Yeah, welcome to retirement. Be enjoying your retirement, Frankie. Oh, I'm taking my fucking prescription pills and going to doctors. Tough getting old. I don't know, man. My family, you only got two people left in my family. My two sisters, and I can't get along with either one of them. I don't know, it just worked out like that, I don't know. I'm a simple guy, and they don't understand it. Too bad. When I was in intensive care for a week, you know who visited me? My co-workers. The vice president of the place. But then again, I didn't tell anybody. That's all I need, Judy, to be there all for the frickin' day. That would have been a fucking, not a nightmare. That would have been if Kathy fucking visited me. That would be a nightmare. Then when I went to uh, Culver School Hospital for a week of rehab. Yeah, Mike Steffens, my manager, my uh, mechanic called me up. That was very nice. He heard it from Ron, Ron at uh, Wiley. She was calling me up a couple of times, the vice president again. <coughs> I thank her. She made my. Uh, she gave me a freaking uh, sheriff's badge, so to speak. <coughs> I had a doctor dismissed from my case. <coughs> And I, I had two nurses kicked out. Draw. What, two, two nurses are going to break my balls? Ain't happening. <laughs> that nurse came in and told me, they're not going to be taking care of you. Anyway, that's in the past, and let it stay there. Yeah. It warms up a little bit. Yeah, fucking 9.30. You think uh, she did my mail yet? Yeah, I think I'll go up to Richfield and get the Chinese. The fucking egg foo young is to die for. So is the soup. The wonton soup, I'm telling you, it's worth the trip alone. I get that. I get two meals out of it, you know. I don't know. 
too much coffee, too much cigars. Jeez, I wish I can get some fucking pig's feet up here, man. Pork neck bones, pig's feet, make a nice fucking sauce. You'd be surprised what I could do with a hot plate. I don't know, I got all the time in the world do things and I don't fucking want to do anything. I don't know. What was I going to do? I was going to do a uh, shave video with the uh, schooner shave soap. I want to check out my new straps. I fucked around a little, <clears throat> a little bit with my straps yesterday. Three inch, nice. I never had three inch straps before. <clears throat> and they're long too, which is nice. You get long drawers, you know. Waiting for my mustache to grow. Yeah, fucking 9.30. Ten o'clock I have lunch. Yeah, ten o'clock I eat lunch. It's funny. Whew. Fucking flowers are starting to bloom. What are they? What the hell do you call them? daffodils? Life changes. Uh, I looked on Facebook, Peyton. I don't know if it's an old post or a new post. She got a job uh, as an administrative assistant. Because <laughs> she left transport. They probably fucking told her, like, hey, man, you know, you've been out a long time. You either put some hours in and we're going to terminate you. Her mother, I think, has some fucking pull over there. So she'll be administrative assistant. Per diem. I don't know. That fucking department went downhill. <laughs> yeah. Like I say, I feel sorry for Henry. He's, he's, a, he's probably about 60 three years old now? Where's he gonna fucking go at his age? He's gotta hang on. He wants to get out at like 65. Hope he can make it. Paul's just full of anger. What the hell? You don't know what happened, man. You know, he could get pissed off and walk out. He could fucking stay. He could... He's not gonna transfer. Harold got fucking fired. Rightfully so, about fucking time. He put in like 13 and a half, almost 14 fucking years before he got fired. He was a fucking scumbag the whole the whole time. Fucking thief, liar, cheater. Fucking prick. Funny, he'll make you laugh, but you're a piece of shit. That's funny, because in the end, fucking did it to himself. They didn't do it to him. Policies didn't do it to him. He did it to himself. <laughs> Everything down the fucking drain. Full-time job. Benefits. I don't know if he'll get his pension. <laughs> he didn't have to work weekends. 
because the bus don't run. He drives, rides the fucking bus, don't have a license. 55-year-old man, don't have a license. He didn't have to work weekends, he didn't have to work holidays. Oh, the bus ain't running. Fucking snows, they, they shut the bus down. I can't come to can't come to work today. Bus ain't running. Give me a sick day. He fucking got paid. Judy's still there. She's doing tens. If anybody gets. Every fucking job she pulls that. Boy, Sarah's everybody. If anybody gets. She don't do any patient moves. She just does stat labs. Poor fucking Bill. Talk to Bill. Judy still days. I said anybody gets. He says, yeah, she's still doing that. Yeah, well, you fucking let her. Holy shit. I've seen a lot of... Transporters come and go, managers come and go, coordinators, supervisors come and go, secretaries come and go. If I can go back to the way it was when I first started, the manager we had, the coordinator, the way things were, I'd go back, man. The teal shirts, wear any fucking pants you want, as long as they're not blue jeans. Plenty of staff all the fucking time. We had fun. We had fucking fun. Joe Fisher, got a little room in the lobby. We had the wheelchair room. He had a boom box. He used to play uh, Megadeth. Crank it up the fucking ten and bit blast it. Da -da 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 we'll be in there, we'll be banging kicking chairs and fucking banging. I don't know how we got away with it, man. I don't know how we got away with it. Had a lot of fucking fun. Mary, the alcoholic, she used to come in, ah, the fucking hot. She used to go into the morgue in the fucking icebox with the dead bodies to cool down. Fuck. Oh, we had some fucking doogies. Ex-convicts, fucking child molesters, thieves, alcoholics, drug addicts. Fuck, we had we had it all, man. We had it all. What a mis mismatched fucking bunch. Yeah, we had some fucking times, man. Good times. You know, it was like. I really look forward to going to work every day, man. We got the work done. We had fucking fun. Good times, man. All gone. That lasted about five years. And then the fucking shit started going downhill. Well, I guess started after my first manager the lady who hired me, and she was great. She she cared about us. She looked out for us. The only one. I don't know. What do they say? You got your memories. Yeah. That I got. My memories. Too bad you can't go back, right? Alright, I guess I'll go to the post office. Catch you later.